Hello, and welcome to the Flare development video for April 24th, 2014. It's been a while since the last video, as development has slowed down a bit. The number of open issues we have for the 1.0 milestone is pretty short now. So, I'll start by going over what's new. We now use full paths when referencing files from config files. Previously, we were forcing a specific directory structure in many places. For example, NPCs were always stored in a folder of the same name, and that folder was typically omitted when referring to those files. The new way is more consistent as every file name is now relative to the root of the mod. I added more config file attribute documentation to the code. The documentation has also been added to the wiki, so be sure to take a look at that if you're interested in modding Flare. Support for non-alpha images has been removed. This was a mostly unused feature and it added extra maintenance work for modders. The removal of these images also brings down the file size of the game data tarball a sizable amount. Pseudoman provided a patch that fixed fast button presses from being read properly. And we fixed a lot of small bugs as they've popped up. Now, I'd like to take the opportunity to look at a couple bugs I found interesting. The river encampment crash and jumping corpses. We got a bug report where the player's game was crashing when they moved towards this area of the river encampment map. I remembered completing this area without a hitch, but lo and behold, my game crashed when I went to reproduce the bug. Thanks to Valgrind, I was able to narrow down the cause. The game was trying to render tiles that had no image data. Looking deeper, I found that the tiles without image data weren't actually in the tileset definition. As a solution, I added some code to remove any invalid tiles. Another bug report we got explained that corpses were jumping when the player slid against a wall. Reproducing it was kind of inconsistent, and it didn't affect living creatures, powers, or map tiles. It was very apparent that this was a rounding error, but the solution to it was unclear. After experimenting for a while, I came up with something that worked. The solution was to align these entities with a multiple of a simple floating point number, like 1 over 16. Here's a before and after look at the bug. Pay close attention to the pile of gold on the ground. That's all for this video. Flare is free software, so if you want to play it, create a new mod, or help contribute to development, you can do so using the links in the description. Thanks for watching.